Hey there everyone, this is Aokao playing uh, Robot Watch It All and I'm pretty sure that today we're probably gonna be able to end the uh, ice cream. Oh, oops. So someone was like, hey, maybe there's something in the very, very top left. And you know what? That's a good point. There could be something in the very, very top left. There is not anything in the very, very top left. But now we know! Wait, there's a bit of rock there, but I'm pretty sure I got that. I should... <laughs> I should redouble check just in case. So we're gonna go into the very, very top left. Hi. And then we're just gonna drop down. But yeah, that was the last flight upgrade I got, I think. So, alright. Well, now we're sure, though. That's what's important. So, hey there, everyone. This is out. Now. Ah, time for this game. Yeah, okay. That went pretty well. So time for me to legitimately enjoy the game while also just being so frustrated by what the game doesn't land compared to what it actually does very well. It's a, it's a way of life. Uh, no, it's not. That doesn't make any sense. The boss is up there, by the way. There's the ice cream. I mean, the reality is, okay, so I feel like I need to maybe speak more precisely about my complaint about their respawn. Because I understand it. I understand that the game is designed around their enemies respawning. I get it. There is a collect the sprinkles mechanic. There is not enough sprinkles in the game to, you know, not enough enemies in the game to furnish you with all the upgrades you might want to gather, and I understand that. I really do. It's still not an excuse. <laughs> There's still ways to make it better. Uh, that's what it boils down to. Uh, I feel like... Now, there are never any easy fixes. Like, I understand that, and I acknowledge that. But I wonder if it was at least considered Considered, like these following things. I feel like it falls down to two different things. Uh, I feel like the respawn timer is just too small. Um, I think that. Whoa. Like, I don't know what the timer is, but it is. What? Got me. Okay, bullet kind of managed to sneak in, huh? Like, like. I think so, like, I don't know what a timer is, but I think the issue is more that it will spawn in, like, even if you're, like, right there. Like, there should be a combination that determines when something is allowed to respawn. Be both, like, a combo of how long has it been, you know, a timer, but also how far you got. Like, I feel like you kind of want to combine both of them. Uh, would want that, but I don't have the sprinkles. I sure don't. I wouldn't be able to tell because Uber boxing is in the way. All right, now here's the two boxes. Uh, we've got the easiest version of this fight here in remix mode. I don't know. It doesn't matter. I mean, we do have projectiles though. But another important thing I feel like needs to be considered is I don't think every enemy should respawn. Like, I feel like if the purpose of the respawning enemy is to ensure that you have enough resources that you can get in a regular amount of time, then, uh, you should only, basically only the popcorn enemy should, uh, be respawning. What is popcorn enemy? It's an arcade term. Uh, for basically, you know, the small little enemies that essentially only exist to die. Like, you know what I'm talking about. Not saucers. Uh, not the two-layered guy here. But, you know, like the walk-back-and-forth dude that doesn't do anything else. Even the robot that floats up and down and shoots his gun once in a while. That, I get it. And that would make sense. But having upper tier enemies respawn all the time just makes it feel at some point like it is pointless to engage in any combat. Why are you doing that? You are wasting your time. Get out of here. That's what it feels like. And my think, wow, how cow, that is some incredible um, hyperbole here. And to which I would respond, it is my actual bona fide thought. Friend, I'm sorry. 
So, yeah, that's what I think. Like, so, to sort of TLDR, my issue isn't with the respawning itself, it is how the respawning is done. I think it is done badly. Like, and I, you know, I, I don't use words like badly, like, loosely. Like, y'all know this. But, uh, yes. Good times. Oh, sweet, there's a flying saucer here. That makes it more fun. Well, I just died. That's pretty good. Thank you for joining us, dog. Could you not shoot the already dead part and focus on this marvelous rubbery gem here? No? I'm afraid that my dog is a little bit stupid. Oh, just die already, turn. Okay, I can do this from here, which is probably the... the I'm assuming my bullets actually get there. They don't always. Pretty good fight. Okay, we did it. Alright, got sprinkles, because there might be more gates. I mean, the reason why we pop this is not for the prize reward here. Well, this prize reward. That, that's what's going to open up, like, the middle tube, right? Am I going to get there? Eventually. So, I think now... Like, I think I did everything I could here. And I need to go on the other side through, like, the other... I'm seeing the sun here, and I'm like, well, is there a way to get that sun? I don't know. Let's find out. Not from here. So, either we need to find another entrance, or, yeah, it's secretly from the other side. So let's do that! Let's go on the other side! Wow, I can fly for a long time now. That is kinda nuts. Like, I'm just, I'm not gonna fight. If I fight an enemy just more annoying, there is literally no reason to fight. So why would I? I'm not. That's the answer now. Alright, I can take care of that just so I can, like, get to this without too much effort. Alright, I probably want that. I don't know. I don't even know what that really does. I guess it's like, makes me more efficient, so I get maybe more per... No idea, man. Got it, it's mine now. Right, we are gonna get the extra battery. Batteries do kind of just pay for themselves. Here we go, destroy that, please. Thank you. Whoa, check it out. Oh, that's there now. Whoa, wow. Alright, pretty good. Close this open, get burned. Nine seconds for battery. That does not seem right, and I don't think it is right. I mean... Yeah, it's just... Uh, there's a lot. It's just not worth it. It's just not worth... Oh, hey! It's Mr. Bubble! Here to dream! My dog will destroy your self-esteem! That's so Do you really brag about this self? But also, you know, it's kind of very hard to tell where enemies are at some point. But it's okay. We did it. We got money for unlocks and uh, money for unlocking doors. All right, fire more vaults. All right, don't got enough vaults. Explosions. All right, just yeah. Now it's just like screen full of bullets. That's what we want to see. All right, this is our destination. Again, I don't. Uh, I don't care about the little upgrade that's been behind the wall. It's really I'm doing that for the sake of you need to destroy both rooms to get the thing. If you want the thing. And apparently, though, I've decided to explore somewhere else first. Accurate. We're here now. Wow, two gates for a whole bunch of stuff that I barely understand. Uh, I can't afford it, so why not? Yeah, this is like all the, uh... Okay. 
but see here, they made it a little bit annoying. Uh, I got an upgrade. I got an upgrade. See, because they blow up. That's a thing. They're little great bombs. They explode when it's grape time. It's pretty weird. Alright. Alright, well those- I'm not getting super death destroy achievement. That's fine. Oh! Open the world to another place! Uh, that I've already been to, I'm pretty sure. Alright, let's just do it. Land here. Destroy turret. Dog! Shoot. No, shoot at the little crystal thing! Dog! Don't shoot at the dead turret! The dead turret is not gonna do anything! You fool! You foolish dog! I mean, you're useful now. Shoot down! Oh my god, that dog is not very smart. You know, like, you know, all dogs are good. I acknowledge that. Sometimes the dog can be a bit silly. Here's the door of the garden. I kind of like this. This is kind of neat. And, you know, there's a bunch of upgrades here. I'm just gonna literally jump up into a bullet. I'm gonna do that. You can't stop me. I did that on purpose, because I wanted to. But more importantly, I think that's everything on this side. And now we are gonna go up the middle because, to repeat myself ad infinitum, we opened up the thing. Like we did, we, we did that, right? Yeah! Right, pit stop, it's just smart. We're gonna flow right up the middle. Oh, okay. Oh, and here we are at Battle Central. I had a little bit less to do, it turns out. I thought that the inside of the ship would have been a little bit more involved, but that's okay. Alright, Kitty Commander, this is it. Look at your face. It's a pretty good face. Blow up the world all over the place, and then stop. Cause a kitty. Turn it way. Alright, dog probably wants to get involved. Cause that violence, dog! Uh-oh. Dog! Keep causing violence! While I cause explosions! Oh shoot! I'm on the wrong side! Wow, that was... Oh shoot, I'm like still super on the wrong side. That was not the main ice cream catch at all! But it's... I, okay, so I should have led the fight a little bit more to the side. Alright, that's a little bit shorter an episode, but... I prefer it too short and too long. Uh, triple scoop! Not so fast. So I did it, I, look, I did it a normal amount. But look, I got the superstar, so it's all good. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Let's do the game history. Because we didn't do it for that one. Your grand finale. And of the three, I still think I like the first one best. I just think it... I think by sticking to the basics, the game is stronger. But this one's pretty good. The original Quatrology. Yeah, September 2010. Mm -hmm. Metroidvania with variable degrees of power. Okay, that's fair. Yeah. But the thing is, with this style of game, making yourself deadlier is something you feel. Uh, super freewheeling. <laughs> the game is a nar. I just played an RPG, y'all. Precision challenge of game is like Y and Puppy. Mm -hmm. So Y is gonna be back to the precision. I honestly kinda don't remember at all what you do in Y Easy, other than you could collect the man, and that was fun. Robot want bird. <laughs> People just love birds. Uh. All right. This is pretty nice. This was a pretty nice little method. But yeah, but we're not done. Uh, technically speaking, there's now the off- like, every- every- everyone has, like, a little side thing. And this has a, like, a wave-based endurance battle game thing we're gonna do. I'm gonna look at that next time.